Uh, guys, just make sure there's one corner by the cage per athlete. The rest can sit on the blue chairs here on the left or be here by the bags. And kindly do chair the athletes on. I would appreciate that. Thank you. Our ref is Indian pro MMA fighter, Mr. Shivraj. Here we go. This is submission only. UBI rules. UBI rules. EBI rules, excuse me. For our spectators, this is a submission only tournament. One person per athlete in the corner, please. Thank you.
so we have Alan uh, who's blue corner he is he at this point in time uh, he had the red naked choke but now um, Roshan got two on one so Alan only has his right arm around uh, Roshan's neck now he's going back for the RNC This is a EBI submission only tournament. Referee in the cage, Shivraj, Indian MMA fighter. So it seems Roshan can turn in and he does and he is in Alan's guard. I think Alan may have squeezed pretty hard and maybe his arms are a little rubbery. He seems pretty gassed out. He's shaking his hand. Not sure if he's hurt his fingers or what the case is. Back into the guard. It's Alan's corner calling for a triangle. Clears the legs, does Roshan. Tries to go for the side but loses it. Now, now he gets it on the other side. Has his left around, uh, Roshan has his left arm around. Alan's neck. He's on side control, but he's not really putting any pressure. Alan seems a little gassed out now. He's corner calling for a bridge and shrimp. Roshan was going knee for knee on belly and wanted to get the mount, but was unable to. Now in half guard. The crowd and the ref looking on. These boys are, are very new to BJJ. Uh, here at Superhuman Battleground, the team wants to develop new athletes and they're giving these new athletes chance of a lifetime with the kind of setup they have over here and the facilities they are providing for these new coming fighters. It's Two points. Submission only. Submission only. And there is less than two minutes left in this round. After that, if it there is no submission, it will go into two one-minute rounds to see who gets the fastest escape or a sub. Spider guard or the back control. Trying to put pressure, but he's using a lot of energy. He's not. But once again, these boys are pretty new. We do appreciate the effort, and this will teach them a lot. He can't jump to his left. Russian. He's in full guard. One minute. One minute. Allen hanging on. The last minute of the match seems it will go into OT over time. The ref, Mr. Shivaraj, keeping a very close eye on the competitors, trying to use more of a wrist pressure as opposed to forearm is Allen. Excuse me, is Roshan. Roshan is red, Alan is blue. These boys seem very, very tired. And the ref stands them back up. Brings them to the center of the mat. Last 10 seconds. Three. And sets them back. Clears the legs, tries to go, and that's the end of 10 minutes. Match will go into overtime at this point in time. There will be two one minute rounds to see who has the fastest sub or escape. It will either be after a flip, the winner gets either the spider guard or the back.
Once again, this is the first edition of Superhuman Battleground Jiu-Jitsu Special. Jiu-Jitsu in the cage. Gi and no gi, EBI rules, submission only. Our referee in the cage, Indian, prominent Indian MMA fighter and purple belt in Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, Mr. Shivaraj. We thank our sponsors, Eye of the Tiger, Bar and Grill, Superhuman Gym, and here is the coin toss. Blue wins the toss. So Roshan elects, wins the toss and elects to excuse me Alan wins, uh, wins the toss and elects to take the back and and he has one arm, his right arm around the neck, clearly under the chin but he has uh, Roshan has control of his left wrist And he goes for a RNC. His, from my angle, I'm not able to see where his left arm is at. Alan's left arm. Roshan is trying to defend. He's trying to get the arm going behind the neck, if it or behind the head, if it is. Kind of has a body triangle. Does Alan? Blue corner. He can could have flattened him out. In the last 10 seconds of the ma of the minute, Roshan is trying to survive, and that's the end of the first minute. Now the second overtime, and we will see what Roshan, what position Roshan takes, and what is he able to do with it. Roshan as takes the back as well. Let's see how this one goes. So if, if this does not end in a submission, we will see who was in more danger or who escaped the submission fastest. And there you go, starting from seat belt. And Alan is Almost turning into his opponent, but Roshan is holding on tight still. He has one hook almost and now goes to a body triangle. And he does not have the right arm under the chin. It is more of a crank. Not sure why Alan pulling the arm down, he needs to be pushing it up. Really expending a lot of energy aboard. He straightens Roshan's arm, trying to turn in, trying to turn into his opponent. Last 10 seconds. And he has him blocked with the instep. And he almost does. And that's the end of the second overtime.
any statement down the line. So we just let us make decision and buy what so we can add it in. Correct. Like buy a main line of the we can give it to. Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, we are going to a technical decision by the referee. And by the technical decision, it is Alan Blue Corner. This is a win by Alan Blue Corner. Technical decision.